Okay, we back, man. Hey, big boy history, man. Like, this shit is astronomical, man. Because if you know, you know. If you don't, you mm-hmm. don't. But what we ain't going to let y'all do, y'all ain't going to erase no history. In come on. Because that's the shit y'all like to do these days. But we always want to know where we come from, where this shit started at, and who the major players in this shit. Because y'all niggas want to cry about so much shit. You know what I mean? But y'all don't even know y'all history. You know what I mean? So you got to know something to get somewhere, man. Mm-hmm. My man TK Barron in this bitch, man. Back at it. Come on, Give him this motherfucking flowers, man. Because this man right here been putting this shit down since forever. Forever. You know what I mean? It's that forever mm-hmm. type shit right here, man. It's real. And so I think I was, when we left, I was talking about uh, my homegirl, Joey, who's from Nashville, who okay. was Dallas Austin, first artist. Uh, on his deal with Colum- uh on his deal with Clive Davis. Is that female? Yeah. That's the one that um she went with Big Gip, right? Shout out to Gip. You feel me? I yeah. know my history. Yeah. Y'all niggas don't know this history yeah. shit, man. Yeah. Come on. Straight from Antioch. So all y'all yeah. anybody went to McGavick, if you went to Overton and McGavick, you know Joy. Yeah. Joy was the Neo Soul singer, yeah. the template for Erica Badu, yeah. and a lot of stuff. My know? cousin, uh, my big cousin Mingo Johnson told me about Joy. Yeah, I remember Mingo. Shout yeah. out to Mingo. I know Mingo, yeah. half brother Alpha Cole. Alpha, yeah, big cousin. Big Al, big, Come on, big, big Al, baby. I, drive, I drove by the spot on 10th Ave today. Okay. Yeah, so I came up off of Walkers too. Mm. With my big brothers. You know, if you if you a real South Side, you a real out South nigga, yeah. then you know 10th Ave. Come right? on. From Ackland, oh. right? All the way down to Montrose. Come that on. That was a dope hangout. Come on. That was the dope. So I'm going to tell y'all about how shit worked. If you go to the west side of Detroit, okay. if you go to motherfucking the north side of Queens, yeah. if you go to the west side of LA, yeah, man, that's how 10th Ave was. It's mm. like a, it's a, it's, I don't want to say a suburb, but it's, it's black people with big houses mm-hmm. and niggas that would shoot your ass down and was selling drugs right there. Mm. Right there, nigga. Right there. When no prizes. We went, and it's crazy because I'm from the other part of South. Like, I'm my physical location, my whole life, I physically lived on 425 Houston Street. My whole life. Okay. My, and that's why I was raised at, right? But I went to school on Halcyon. And then Mal and Doug was my big brother, so I was always on Wall Kirch and Tent. Ooh. And them niggas went, if you was over there, you went to Overton. <laughs> if, you was, uh, if you was on the other side of Tent, you was a Hillsborough nigga. You feel me? Mm. So all that, all them game, game that I learned from everybody, and once again, Nashville, drug city. The gangs was city all, you know, dope. gangs is coming in, but it was it was all about y'all know that this is a paper city. Man. You gotta have some money Tri-city. in your pocket. The tri-state. Come on, man. We gotta have. It. You gotta have. It. And see, you know, Memphis is, you know, that's that's Western Tennessee. So you getting that? Yeah. Uh, you getting that Arkansas? Uh, uh, Texas yeah. and Mississippi. Yeah. You know, see, we going to Alabama and we going to Georgia. Mm. We got a different type of thing. You mm. know what I'm saying? Or we going to Kentucky. That's our tri-state. For sure. You feel me? That's how we going. Nigga, for this, pow. Yeah. I'm finna go get my shit up there. I'm gonna get some work. You know, you go get yeah. some grass back up in, yeah. you know, the bluegrass yeah. state. You go get that up in Kentucky. Yeah. You go put your work down in northern uh, Alabama. Mm. Right? You go put your work down. If anybody, what's my mm. nigga name? What was his name? Ooh, he was the nigga down there. He had that whole little project sold up and he put out records too. I met him through Mika B. Mika and, B. And, uh, uh, Rollo B. Rollo on, B man, was legend. from, uh, North, he was from, uh, he was from Alabama. He was from Huntsville. Yeah. Yeah, man, I, I went down. He there. moved to Antioch, though. He moved to Antioch. He, he put us on the map. He like, was. Really. It was both of them, though. He had Alabama yeah. and he had Antioch. Yeah, I yeah. remember that. Yeah. And um, that's that's when I came back. So I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all getting to L.A., going from Atlanta to uh, L.A. So I get okay. to L.A. It's the underground shit, and they got uh This is uh when niggas is rhyming fast. They super fine. <laughs> you either in L.A. at that time you was a gangster. <laughs> Mm. Like it's all gangster rap. There's nothing else popping in the city, but it is. You got niggas like Skilo. I wish I was a baller. A little bit. Okay. All okay. them niggas, they all in the hood. Okay. So once again, I'm on a thing. I'm with my people. I'm dealing with Islam. They tell me, hey man, go out there. You want to meet the guys? You want all your people, the Muslim, whoever, whatever you fucking with. They in Lamar Park. I get out to Lamar Park. They out there rapping. Project Blow. That's what it was called. Mm. They all the Project Blow rapping. So I'm like, this is not my scene, bro. I don't understand it, I, but I'm I'm I don't got no choice. I I know what I'm dealing with from Snoopy and 
Uh, I seen how that was at the death row. Right. They they miles ahead. They they a million. They had a million and one. They the top. Snoop at this time is a pop icon fighting a murder case. Mm. Uh, January ninety six, Tupac puts out All Eyes on Me. Yeah, I already found out Dr. Dre went up there early January ninety six. Okay, I'm not fucking with that. I'm <laughs> fucking with Ron G, but I'm not fucking with that. Ooh. So now I'm kind of like on my own. So I'm like, I might as well try to figure how I'm gonna, how I'm gonna figure it out. So we run into some Jamaicans. I start fucking with this bitch, excuse me, this lady, and um, her her baby, her future baby daddy is down with um, Rohan Marley. That's um, Lauren Hill baby daddy. Mm. So we got the the hair. I I, nap, I ain't got my hair done in so long. My shit damn near <laughs> like dreads. It's nappy than a motherfucker. So I just let it nap up. <laughs> they give us some work. We we go on the east side. We in we in um, kitchen crib hood. Mm. We living in East Coast hood, but we in over there and we selling weed, acting like we Belize and in Jamaican, mm. selling weed, knocking sacks off just so I can have money in my pocket sure. and get around. And now I'm learning South Central. But remember, I done went through all this shit in Nashville. And when you living in Nashville, my partner is li- Shannon is living in Antioch. Right. He's 21 with a house. Yeah. My other partner is they 22 with houses, right? So you telling niggas you, you going to go to L.A. and nigga not have no money and not do this and that? They looking at me like I'm crazy. Mm. But I'm telling these niggas I got it. It's in my head. I got to I, I gotta figure it out. I know what I got to do. But I'm also knowing I got to have money in my pocket. Yeah. So I'm, I'm risking everything to, to sell this weed. I'm not going to go out there and move no powder, no, no nothing. Right. I'm going to move some weed. So I start moving. Then I start... I go to this little school thing to get back in school. Okay. So they put me in Crenshaw High School at, uh, <laughs> at night. I go to Crenshaw at night. I go to community. Uh, it's called Community Bill. So after the L.A. riots, Bill Clinton get his money. He got a mm. federal program to for get game bangers in school. So I'm going to school. I'm smoking weed with niggas from Hoover. Mm. We on uh, Manchester and Vermont, which the five deuces, the Hoovers, the eight trays. I'm all, I'm in the mix. <laughs> I'm there. I'm fucking hoes. I'm learning the etiquette on. <laughs> Hood rats, yeah, and yeah. Mexican hoes, and all this type Ooh. of shit. I'm, I'm getting it in. At the same time, I got the music shit. So we, we there. We trying to get up to Hollywood. Okay. So we going to clubs at Hollywood. We don't have the inside game on, on the music industry. Okay. Just me being me, a politician. I meet this girl. Boom. She on the west side. She from twenties. Boom, I knock her down. I'm like, yo, I got to get out of my crib. She's like, cool, you come stay with me. I'm like, nah, I got my cousin, though. She's like, shit, he can stay with me, too. So, boom, me and cousin, oh, we work it out. Boom. We pop up on the west side. So, we move to Washington and Ridgely. Shout out to, shout out to all my... Street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, if, if you from... Uh, that's Marvin Hood. So, you know, that's the Marvins. We moved to the Marvin Hood. We moved on the Ridgely block. So, at this time, I'm moving to L.A., Everybody, if you if you a certain age, they had the party crews. Every hood had a party crew, mm. or they had little subset crews. So West LA is gangster town, right? So once again, coming from the south, you just know Crips. I don't know Crip Different. politics. Yeah, yeah, I don't. Yeah, I don't know yeah, yeah. all this shit. This is yeah. the '90s, my nigga. You feel me? Yeah. Ain't no internet. Ain't no niggas telling you. I don't know moving. I don't know trades. I'm learning all this yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah. I'm picking this shit up. And then also, like I said, I, when I first moved there, we live in 60, we live on 67th and Broadway. That's East Coast, right? So the niggas that I do know out here that I met in my travels, they are. They neighborhood crips, right? So, but it's not, they, it's, I, I, it was a different era. So you learning shit, but you not a, you not in a gang. So it's only so much shit yeah. they saying to you. So I moved to Mid City and everything is different. So they uh they trades. Everything moving. Well, these niggas everything rolling, everything moving. They a little different. They live 10 minutes from Beverly Hills. Mm. They live by the Beverly Center. They got the hoes. They go to Fairfax High. They go to uh they go to uh, Hamilton. They go to fucking my daughter. They go to Pal- my daughter go to Palisades. They go to Palisades. I'm learning all this shit. I'm I'm meeting all these different type of girls. Me and my cousin from Antioch, we on the block, and who pulls up on the block? Will Smith. I'm like, what the fuck is he doing over here? <laughs> they like his baby mama from over here. Uh, so the, her, her, her brother, he's dropping him off after the Fresh Prince. 
Mm. This nigga, uh, this is also the last season of the Fresh Prince. Mm. I'm out there. So Will Smith is about to do Independence Day.